Maple Farm. My name is John Greenway, and today we are sorting out to get the horses for 500 pounds. We can build ourselves a pond and that will go there. Uh, there is our pond. Now I've got a pond to get some water. We can back down just there and get some water. It's a nice pond. It's a bit big actually. We've got a bit more pond than we wanted, but uh, yeah, that is the pond. So we've got water. So now we need to get back to our tractor we want to purchase our mower the mower we have in is the Simper which will cost us £1,000 we need to make some A tedders the smallest tedder we've got is that one it's 11000 so we shall buy that. Next thing we need is a windrower. That one will do us. We only need the smallest windrower we can get, which is 10,000. And we need now to get back to the farmyard. We need to purchase our brought the pit over, the New Holland is still, oh, we crashed into that, never mind, it is ours so it doesn't really matter, oh, so now we want to push it out of the way, Simpa Pura is what we want to fasten on, there we go, push that on and head back to the farm and you will see us purchase our first couple of horses, we got the grant from the government to help us with the horses, uh, well to build the pond, it's a wildlife pond, we are going to encourage frogs and things like that to go into there, and once we get back to the farmyard we will get the horse paddock and the first two horses in or oh, we needed a water trailer what's worth purchasing we'll have to pop back get the water trailer give the horses some water take the trailer down to the combine and pick the oats up we've got some oats to feed to the horses so we will have that until such time as we get some grass cut Uh, we could also do with a front loader tractor to shift the bales as well and the equipment to shove them in but at the moment we need to either purchase or lease a baler or we could get the A turned and uh, just get a collector for that we shall see as it goes on. We may well just get a forage wagon thing to collect the grass, feed it to the horses, and uh, or turn it into a windrow it and 
so it's like but uh, the horses will be across this side there is our Near pond our house and so the horses will come into this area we only need a small horse paddock so we should jump up there we should come across and the horse paddock actually can come right down this bottom end it's our land right the way down here Let's have a look at animal pens. The nearest, cheapest horse pass paddock we can get is 50,000. So the troughs there and troughs there. No, we don't want to be just there for some reason. paddock will go to there. So where is our feeding trough? Right in the middle of the pen. So that will go to there. go to that, there we go, so we have now got a nose paddock, now let's have a look and see, so yeah we've got a nose paddock there, we'll go to open there, that's lovely, we come out down to here, this is where we blow in, this is where we buy the horses, so we shall buy a pinto, and a chestnut or a black horse actually or a dun a dun will do we'll have the dun confirm that two horses for ten thousand six hundred so the feed goes in there water will go into there so we shall drop the grass mowers off, start our tractor back up, we shall drop the grass mower off, just near at the moment, we need to get some water and some oats, that will be the first two jobs to do, we shall park that tractor there, because we want to go and get some oats first of all, that will be the main part we need to get done today. And we shall go get the oats for our horses. Not very far to go to get to the oats, so it's all good. We want to go into this field here down to the combine, just pick up the one tank of oats, it will give them some food until such time that give us food for the horses until such time that we there we go, let's get these oats in it won't fill the trough up probably but it will give them something to eat until such time that we get the harvest started again tomorrow but today is going to be the I've well, got two ton of going to get up to three tons so uh, we are pretty good and now we shall three and a half ton that will do us Led back to the yard. We can cut this grass, what's in this field. Grass we'll cut from anywhere at the moment. We're not going to have a dedicated grass field. I don't think we'll need that much hay and straw. We do need a front loader, which we may lease for the time being. But, uh, get round here, pick up the old 
horses are not in, they need their food put in, in the trough. So here we go. And now we shall line ourselves up for the trough. Feed them their oats, they need oats, they also need some hay putting in at some point, but as long as we've got oats for now that will keep them going. So that will then stop there until so it's time we start the harvest again. Okay, so the oats. Yeah, the oats is filled in nicely. Let's have a look and see on our animals, see what they need. So they are 5% trained. They are worth £2,975 at the moment. So we've got Lady and Flipper. They need hay, water and straw. So back we go. So we need to buy ourselves a water tanker that will be in amongst the animal technology probably is it? So we need to buy an Aquatrans which we shall purchase and we shall need to get a loading wagon just the smallest one will do us it's an expensive thing as well. So at the moment we shall lease the loading wagon. Which will get us some straw and some hay to put in. So now we shall take the peat again. Go back down and pick up the water bowser. Going the wrong way, so yeah, we shall go and fetch some water for them. They will have oats, they will have water. We have got a helper who is going to train the horses for us. We'll buy two more horses tomorrow. Uh, each day we buy two horses, then after the first two horses I've got to their full potential in value. We shall sell those two and purchase two more. We do need to get an horse box of course to start moving them to save a bit of money at some point. Uh, yeah, we need to get, we need to get a baler as well on the job. We have got to start paying off the loan shortly as well, so we could pay a bit off that as well. We'll just see, once we get sorted out with the horses, how things go from there. This tractor already done 15.3 hours and it's, it could actually go on the trail up in the combine. My brother Peter Greenway is planning on coming to help us and join in on the farm. He's going to bring, if he comes, he will put some money into the business. So we shall see whether he comes or not. He's talking about coming and investing in the farm, which will mean we can probably. If we don't buy any more land we can pay off the loan or if we don't pay off the loan we can buy some more land. Either way it would help a great deal. And do we know what he's doing? But, uh, here we go now, so back up here. Now I shall head back to the farm back into the pond we've had dug and uh, get some water for the horses as long as we've got some oats and we've got some water 
then we can concentrate on getting some hay cut, getting some straw not sure really how it's going to happen, we've got to get ourselves a front loader tractor as well which not going to be a cheap option to get so we will see moving forward we are struggling to expand the farm especially with the big mortgage hanging over it we shall do our best to get things Sorted nicely. Almost missed the junction there. But, uh, water trailer will fill up, which will fill the horse trough and then park the water trailer up in the shed. Not far now away from the yard, you can see the house there showing up in the distance but, uh, yeah, it's uh, all looking good as we come forward from here now these horses should bring in some money Okay, it's like ourselves yeah, around. There we go, we fill the drop up from there. So back in whilst the pump is running. Those lily pads will be ideal. We've got some fish in here as well, we've got koi carp and mirror carp some goldfish and different bits so uh, gives us a pond for the garden and also a place to get some water from okay the water tank is full now we've got to make sure we get out of here a little bit of a tight area but uh, there we go we're out and so now we've got to make sure we get to the edge oh. everything a little tight around here but uh, there we go now we can take this water give our horses a drink keep them happy There is the water going into the animals. And we'll be filling their trough up nicely. We've got that filled. So we've got oats, we've got water. Head straight down beyond the tree and around. Uh, everything on this farm working out pretty well at the moment, I think. Put the water tanker in here. Um, we shall head down and put the grass mower on this mow what grass we can uh, let's have the grass mower put on it's fallen over hopefully it will pick itself back up It 
will bounce its way back up and uh, flop in. So around where the hope field is, we will go around the outside of the field, collect ourselves up some grass. No, gone down the wrong roadway. Pop down this roadway. So we can get ourselves some grass. We'll then fetch the A tedder off camera probably, but uh, is cutting nicely we're going round here at least once we'll give them the A they need need of doing Some the way. okay that is running well So soon have some A for the horses. So when you join us tomorrow, we may well be cutting A. And it will be collected up with the collector. And that was 45,000 for that. I mean, we're going to lose money on it now if we sell it. So we could have probably got a baler and leased ourselves a tractor of some description, but uh, we really do need a front loader. There we are back around to the front. So we'll go around twice. Get ourselves. And they chopped. Keep these horses well fed. We need to find a way of dumping straw into the pen. Round we go. Everything working well. So yeah, everything's uh, coming together on the farm thus far. We've still got 92,000 left, so we could have bought a baler instead of the grass collector, but collecting A with the... Okay, so that one out, come around there. That's lovely. We are now tied up to the Last bit. And that will do for now. This simple grass mower, it's not the biggest of grass mowers, but it works a treat for what we Just need for the old. We shall continue on, finish off the day, which time we shall join you back tomorrow when we shall continue on with our harvest. Let's grass mow up and come up here and uh, go to the back of there. There we go, drop that down nicely. And as we head off to pick up the rest of the equipment we're going to get down here. 
We will go and get the trailer and see if it will manage with the straw for us. If not, we shall park it up, empty the straw out, park it up and uh, bail it and find some way of getting ourselves the loader tractor with a bail fork or whatever on the front to get the straw into the pen. We may need a straw blower buy-in as well. It's nice weather, I mean, we could have really done with getting on with the harvest, but we wanted to get these horses in, they will not going to bring an right income in the get-go. But once we've got them and got them trained, then they will start to bring all money in after they've got fully trained then we should be able to make 80 and 90 thousand and probably say 55 60 thousand profit each and every day horses may well turn out to be the savior of the farm So we will join you once we get back to the farm and load okay, up the Okay, we are back for the experiment loading with the wagon. straw. This machine will do the the A of course, but uh, I want to now make sure we are getting straw in. I don't want to put too much in because we may well not be able to put it into the all stable. Okay, so we should spin around here. If this works, all well and good. If not, we've got to find some way of getting ourselves a load of tractor. This Fiat, there is no front load attachments to fit it. And anything that is cheap we can't seem to find a way of getting it done for so will this work i'm not sure i'm not sure this is going to work actually oh hang on it may well be working Have a look and see what it says on our horse thing, on our animals. So straw, yes, lovely. We can manage without having a baler, so that is going to be good. How well it will last and how long it will last, we don't know. But we have now got oats, straw, water. So, uh, yeah, lovely. Just have a quick ride on our horse. Yeah, 
see where the source goes. So, anyway, all that's left to say, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please give it a like, give it a share. If you are new to Summer Farm Estates and would like to see more of the work we do here, please subscribe to the channel. Give that bell a knock, it will tell you when we do these videos, when we do our live streams. Until next time, thank you for watching and goodbye for now.